Where are we, Jackson? We are at Cracker Barrel. We are at that place and... <laughs> We just wrapped the leg workout, so it was supposed to be a foot challenge, but uh, I'm fucking scared to do a foot challenge. <laughs> so we're gonna have some, we're gonna have a lot of food now, but it's just not gonna be a challenge because I don't want to rush. I actually want to enjoy the food, and since I'm post competition, I do have a lot of space and I can eat a lot of things. So the the menu is so big. <laughs> I don't know what to choose, so it's gonna take us a while. And once we know what we're gonna order, we're gonna come back. <laughs> it's so fucking, yeah, yeah. Once we we order, we're gonna tell you what we order and see what we're gonna eat. Sunny side. Sunny side. Sunny side up. Yep. And then it comes with a choice of meats. You can do a, a bacon, country ham, sausage, sirloin steak, or sugar cured ham. <laughs> I'll go with the sirloin steak. Sirloin steak, and how would you like that cooked? Mid rare. Uh, medium rare? Yes. All right. We'll be eating this. This is what we chose: cornbread. Cornbread. <laughs> Tell them this is for you, bro. <laughs> that. We got some <laughs> cornbread, and some more cornbread is gonna come. And yeah, we did actually we did order, and it's a pretty huge order. So you're gonna see in a minute when they bring it. We ordered tons of stuff, so we're gonna get everything destroyed anyways. I'm pretty hungry, so because I did legs, and I got the Daiku HD with me to help me flush everything down, all the carbs that I'm gonna digest, indulge tonight. And probably this is my fourth meal, and it'll be my last meal because it's gonna be a fucking big one, yeah. and you're gonna see it. <laughs> um. <laughs> That's a lot of food. <laughs> That's a lot of food. So, I read the menu, and adding everything, that should be around four to five K calories in a sit. What do we have? We have sirloin steak, we have three whole eggs, we have uh, cornbread, pancakes with some butter, we have French toast, with some butter and some ice cream added to that and we got uh, hash browns um, that's it guys um, <laughs> it's going down <laughs> it's gonna be fun <laughs> Can I actually get the plate? Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Good? Mm hmm. Mm. That is good. That, okay. Let me try the ranch sauce. It's better than the one, the one that I had. Way better. Box diving. Everything turn all right for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for having me here and for, for bringing me in this place yeah. and making me enjoy Texas. My last fucking place here. Oh. Yeah.
so I like nothing. <laughs> I know I can eat more, but I don't know why I'm, I'm self doubting my <laughs> ability to eat when I know for a fact I can eat a lot. You can eat a lot. I know. Let me get a feedback from the whole situation. That was easy, first of all. That was really easy for me. I'm always doubting my eating skills. And I know for a matter of fact I can eat a lot. Especially both show. In off season my appetite is big. I eat up to 8,000 calories clean food. And that didn't bother me at all. So I think I'm gonna order some more. We're gonna order some, I, I crave French sauce right now, so. I had like six, seven. Yeah, it was like eight pieces of French toast, eight, eight slides, but it was not enough for me. We're getting more food. Another, another French toast. I mean, uh, carbs. Every, uh, <laughs> carbs. You love carbs. I love carbs. <laughs> I must get one T-shirt like that that says yes, I love yes, carbs. Yes. And I, I from professional bodybuilder, I can, I can now be a professional eater. So <laughs> if I'm if I'm staying in the states, that's 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 the thing that I'm gonna do. <laughs> Being a professional bodybuilder while professional eater, that would be amazing. Get my name on the wall, fame on every single restaurant, and break some records. And that, that, that we, so we in those like that was four around four to five thousand calories and we, we having more now um, and I'm not even helpful like I feel like empty which is I don't know I mean it's probably because of the leg day and I did cardio today I think about I think I'll do more cardio when I go home just 60 minutes for the sake of it <laughs> even though my legs are fucking destroyed <laughs> Won't be a good idea to do another 60 minutes of cardio today. Yeah. Yeah. And tomorrow is Christmas, so. Uh. So, Jackson, let me explain them. Every single day, I'm like, I'm not gonna eat today. Oh I'm, just, I'm just gonna st I'm just gonna keep it clean. And something happens, I end up eating something that's not in my meal plan. You eat again tomorrow, too. And tomorrow, <laughs> I'm gonna eat again. And then I'm gonna eat again. And yesterday, I wasn't supposed to eat, but they had uh, the Jackson's father had a uh, Christmas party, so I ate again. Barbecue, Texas barbecue. Bar Texas food. barbecue. It was so good. Uh, I messed up. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a big, I'm a big mess. And even though the pounds that I gained both show, which were about 25, 30 ish, I would say 30, um, I already dropped like 15. So. We're pretty good. And I've been in shape all year round, so that doesn't mean I have to become fat now. But if I'm gonna eat like this, I'm gonna have my cardio in on a daily. And I don't mind having 60 minutes cardio on a daily basis right now because there's no stress anymore with thinking about competing and so on. It's now time to improve, improvement season. So, yeah, guys, um, we're waiting for the part two of the dinner. <laughs> Oopsie. So we have another eight pieces of bread, French toast, um, alongside some butter and vanilla ice cream. And this is the ultimate combo. And after this, I should be full, I guess, or almost. But somewhat full, semi-full. But this will be the last. <laughs> I, I promise this will be the last. Um, and we have that coke just to keep it healthy. <laughs> we don't want to gain extra fat and so. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna pour some of this uh, uh, 
syrup. It's not sugar free, but it's, it's, it's okay. You can pour some in there a little bit. A little bit. No. Okay. Well, time to get it done. <laughs> this 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 can happen only in America, man. Like people see me and they ask if this is for YouTube, and then they want to know the page where we're posting this. And they were so amazed when they saw that I'm a bodybuilder <laughs> that I'm eating that, that much amount of food. Be good. If I have to choose between um, pancakes, French toast, and waffles, I would say. Merry French toast. I'm gonna fuck the pancakes <laughs> and I'm gonna kill the waffles. No. Yeah. What? what? Is, what? Tell, okay, tell me yours. Merry uh, waffles. Uh, uh, smash the. <laughs> I'm a, dude, I'm gonna smash the French toast. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill the pancakes. I got it. I'm sorry. I got it. Well. <laughs> <laughs> so tomorrow we're having two hours of cardio. <laughs> <laughs> I think. I'm not sure what time the gym closes. I think you gotta go early. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do cardio at home. And have a bike. Do you wanna, do you wanna go to the gym tomorrow at like? 11? Can you do 11? Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, let's do 11. Shoulders. Perfect. The, the trick to not get fat when eating like this is do some kind of activity. You know, people are obese and the problem is they eat like this on a daily basis but they don't exercise or they, they don't move. At least do some kind of a movement. It doesn't have to be lifting weights. It can be all kinds of sports but it's I, I can't imagine having like I've been doing bodybuilding for seven years now and I've been dieting strictly for those seven years like six meals every day without missing a meal like crazy dieting and I can't imagine eating like this all day every day it's just not possible this is something that I do once in a while and now after show the cravings are like big and I'm gonna have cravings for such foods but they'll, they'll go within a month and I'm I even in off season like don't get me wrong guys I don't need like this like on a daily basis even in off season um, in off season I keep it clean most of the times like I have so much food in off season clean food that I don't really think about having something else like a cheat meal or I don't know cheat meal yeah cheat meal cheat day whatever yeah I keep it clean because like my food is so much in off season it gets me pretty full by the end of the day and when you're that full you don't crave anything else no 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 you can't you simply can't because it's just the volume of the food is so much and yeah, this is something that I'll enjoy for the next couple of days, um, one time a day. But again, I do have weight training and I do have uh, cardio sessions every day. So it's not just eating, we're actually putting out. Because today on the leg day I burned around 900 calories and on my morning cardio I burned another 700. And my BMR just to function is about 2K, I would say, for my body, even if not more. But that's 2K, and that's another 2K burned, approximately, let's say 1.56. So that's 3.5 thousand calories in a deficit. So I can have that much amount of calories and not get fat. So today, pre workout, I had around 1,000 calories from three meals and now I'm having a big meal which is around 5,000 calories so that's 6,000 for a day and that puts me in like 2.5k surplus which is okay because tomorrow I'll have again I'll have low carb day and I'll do one big meal at night probably 
because it's Christmas. And yeah, um, this is how we do things. I'm not gonna eat like this tomorrow. I'm gonna have my cardio done in the morning. And yeah, let's get it finished. Okay, so I'm, I'm, I think I'm full. I mean, I'm 80% full. I can have a little bit more, but let's say if I have one more, one more portion of uh, French toast, I'm gonna be end up stuffed. So I'll be stuffed up here. So I'm like, I can say I'm full, pretty full. Yeah. That's a, that's 5,000 calories um, down. And oh, actually. There's more because before that meal, post workout, I had two protein bars. So they had 5,500? Yeah, so they have around 300 each. So yeah, 55, 5,600. Which is okay for a, for a bodybuilder. <laughs> I mean, if I haven't had carbs pre workout and I had like 80 grams of carbs pre workout and I had around 20 grams of fats, around 50 grams of protein. So if I if I switch that meal, if I didn't have that meal or just had protein on that meal and some fats pre-workout, I could probably eat more. And I, I can eat more even now, but I don't want to. Uh, it makes no sense at this point. I have nothing to prove. Yeah. I, I'm not. A, I'm, I'm not. I'm still not a competitive eater. I'll be someday. <laughs> I'll be someday. <laughs> at this point, I'm just bodybuilder. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, me and Jackson, Jackson has been doing amazing work trying to put all this content for you. So check him out. His Instagram is in the bio of every single video, like description. Just go down below. Check his Instagram. His work ethic is insane, and uh, he's being so like crazy filming me here and there, uh, which I appreciate so much. And yeah, guys. Uh, that's a wrap for today. Um, if you haven't used, use my code Valayan for HD muscle. That glycol HD helped a lot actually with those carbs and it's gonna help in the next hours to digest them. And it's not, it, actually it's not only for the, for the carbs. You do have enzymes for, uh, for the uh, proteins and you do have enzymes for the fats. So it helps digest the food way better. And yeah, that's it guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.